What's up? How are you doing? Hope you're having a good day. If not, make it a good day. Sorry it's been so long since I made a video. I've been busy. Not really. I mean, I had time, like, but school, you know, it's like when I get home, tired. And then sometimes I have stuff later to do that day. So it's, you know, kind of hard to make videos in the weekend. It's like time you only time you get, you know, by yourself or like, you know, to without focusing on school and whatnot. So, you know, just to spend time not worrying about school, you know. So anyways, I'm back, whatever. It's we're, we're on Christmas break. So, I mean, I have time for, I guess, days, you know, but uh, I thought I'd just, you know, come back with a little video of a tour of my uh, sneaker collection, if you want to say. Not a lot, certainly not a little, if that makes sense. But uh, let's just, I guess, go right into it. My sneaker collection tour of 2016. So, first, we have the Nike Rashi Run prints, and these aren't in order by no means. Yeah, but this this is kind of in order, like the first one. But here, the Rashis are, uh, as y'all can see, been wearing them out. And these are like my daily shoes, if you want to say. Like, I mean, I have weightlifting, so I use these for weightlifting at school and everything. So, yeah. So those are my first pair of Rashis, and before I even bought these, I was too, I was skeptical about the Rashis. Like I didn't really like them, like the inside. I had some before. I got some from my friend for like five dollars, and I sold them to my other friend for like two dollars because first of all, they felt fake, and I wasn't about to walk around with no fake shoes. If you know what I'm trying to say, you know I'm not trying to, you know I wasn't trying to have no fake shoes. Here are the Rashi prints, digital camo, I guess. Got these last year probably like last september so i had these over a year now these are pretty dope but uh, i put these on i guess i fell in love with them not really though but i mean you know i loved them so yeah i didn't really like them because the sole of them they were fabric but some actually have like some other type of material but yeah so i used to take care of these last year but now they got out of hand and look what they are now you know so Moving on to the next pair. Those down. These Adidas Alpha Bounce. Actually, I don't really like Adidas, but I wanted something different, you know. And by God, these, I love these. Well, I'm not going to say I love them, but yeah, I like them a lot. They're just something different. Actually, my friend had some on. I was like, let me try them on. I like the way they looked on my feet. We were in school, we were in math, and I tried him on. He had like some other pair he got from like his friend, but he was like, I was like, so how much you want for him? He was like, how much are you trying? I was like, how much you talking about? He was like, I would sell them to you no less than a hundred or something. I'm like, uh, I don't know. But went to finish line the next day or two days later, it was like on a Friday, but I went and finished line on Sunday and looked at these and I had a $20 reward at finish line. So I got these for like $70 and they were a hundred, but I think they were like 90 or something, you know? So sorry, bro, I didn't buy your shoes, but hey, I got a better deal if that makes, you know what I'm saying, off of these. And I got these a couple of weeks ago, probably about a month or so ago so yeah next pair rashi ones if y'all can see i have a lot of rashis and that's because i i don't know yeah <laughs> even though i was skeptical about them first these rashis uh, as y'all can see they are not worn or if you can they're brand new i literally they're brand new i got these last week you know so uh yeah i haven't worn these yet but i got these yeah i'll wear these sometime in the new years in the new year since it the second to last day in 2016, unfortunately. Next pair we have Nike Free Runs 5.0. And actually, yeah, yeah, y'all can see these are pretty beat up. I had these since I was in eighth grade and I'm in 11th grade right now, a junior. So had these for what, four or five years? Yeah, and they still last me. I wear these, you know, sometime, you know, now, here, now, now and then, you know. Uh, the shoelaces, if y'all wondering what they are called, they're called Naughty Boys. I got these from our, um, I guess, local, I'm not sure, uh, shoe store. Well, like, it's like a running store, but I got these there. So, uh, y'all want a pair? Go get you, uh, go get you some Naughty Boys. They're actually nice because you don't have to tie them. If you can see, they're called Naughty Boys because they got knots in them. You don't have to worry about tying them. They're, they're for running, so these are perfectly, these are meant for these type of shoes and whatnot. If you put them on Rashi's, it would probably, I mean, they would probably, the reason they're purple, I was going, it was a bowl game that we went to about a couple years ago and got purple shoestrings because the team, well, East Carolina was purple. So yeah, that, I don't know what that is. I think that came on the box. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Got those at finish line also. So next pair, 
We have the Kobe Mentality 2s. Yeah, we have the Kobe Mentality 2s. These, I got these for basketball. I'm playing, I guess, recreational ball, if you want to say. It's uh, for the YMCA. I didn't try out for my high school team because I don't really play basketball. I just wanted something fun to do. And me and my friends, we're going to sign up. But some of my friends, they bailed out on me. But one of my friends, I'm on his team. He, this is like his second year playing. So I'm on his team. So yeah, we want to know currently we had our first game like two weeks ago, a few Saturdays ago. So yeah, but I got these probably about three, three weeks ago. These are nice. Got these at Dick's Sporting Goods. And yeah, they're the budget Kobe's if that makes sense. Or, you know, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, instead of having, like, the Kobe 10s or whatever, he has the mentalities, which they're pretty straight to me, you know? I want the Kobe 10s or whatever, but hey. So, put those to the side. I've actually been getting into shoes this past year. Next, we have the Nike Vapor Untouchable Pros. These are actually, cleats are not in there. Here are the KD Maryland Crab 8. I mean, uh, the Maryland. KD 6 is Maryland Blue Crab, right? Yeah, I think, yeah. These, I bought these off my friend, so that's why there's no box for them. Got these, I got these my freshman year. I was in the library, and he had, he had these on, and I really wanted some KDs, and I was like, bro, how much you want for them? It was like 80, and so I tried them on, and he let me wear them. He let me take them home, so then I texted my mom, or text, I sent a picture to my parents, and I was like, hey, can I get these? He asked me 80 for them, and went home. My dad gave me the money, and the next day I gave it to him. Gave him this money, so yeah. Are these worth eighty dollars? I mean, yeah. I mean, I can't wear these no more, and they're too small. They're like a ten and a half. Yeah, ten and a half. I wear eleven and a half. So, and I try to play basketball. Like I was at basketball practice with these, and before I got the Kobe's, these. Whoo! Yeah, let's just say I almost had to see a podiatrist <laughs> after that. <laughs> so yeah. Next we have Nike Rashi One uh, SEs. These are nice. I love these. Got these at Hibbit Sports. Probably about a month. It was. It was. It was a day after. After Black Friday, so yeah, yeah, about a month ago, yeah. So wore these about twice, and actually they have yeah that happened at school last week. I'm mad at them because you know people be playing around, maybe play fighting, and yeah, so mad about that. So yeah, next we have the Nike Rashi ones, the gray. Yeah, these I had. I got these back in like February, I believe. Love them. Just started wearing them more this past like school year. Um, so, yeah, I wear those every Friday. Like I have, I have a nice, you know, outfit routine. I guess wear these every Friday because Friday is like, cause we have dress code out of school. And if you know, if you know what dress, if you don't know what dress code is, we have to wear just khaki pants. You know, just like blue, black, khaki, those types of colors. And and then with the collared shirt. And so Friday we don't have to wear college shirts we have to wear like a high school shirt or something with our high school that is like clubs and everything so yeah i wear those next we have the nike air max 2015 these i love these a lot i didn't i didn't really like the color at first but then after you start wearing them after like my fifth time wearing them, i was like man i actually fell in love with these and i'm actually mad because probably like a couple months ago i was walking and it was i was i guess i was walking on them awkwardly and next thing you know i think i heard something i know i, I could tell i heard something and i think i popped the bub they still you can still wear them but it's like they're lower than these if you can see these i got these last november so it was like I think uh, I can't remember it was like the day I don't know I got them like before Thanksgiving and then they came yeah I don't remember when they came but I had to order them because they didn't have my size so I love them next we have the <clears throat> Nike one KJ CRD I think these I don't know they're not called Concord no. These, love these. These are like my daily shoes at school. I try to switch it up, but these I just have to go to because they're clean, but you can, I can still like get them dirty, you know? Like I care about them, but at the same time, I don't care about them. Like if there's, if I have to walk through grass, I'll go through grass. And if it's raining, I'll wear these, you know? So yeah, and by the way, but yeah. So put those down. Next we have the Nike one, Nike Rashi one, uh, Hyper, I don't know. Okay, but H-Y-B, H-Y-P-B-R. I don't know, but yeah, these. Yeah, turquoise. No, I don't know. Of the color, those are actually the lighting. You can't really tell. These are. I don't know if you can see, but yeah. I got these at Finish Line two months in like September. They had this fall sale, I guess, or something. And I got these. These were like forty dollars. I mean, I can't complain. You know, 
just another pair of shoes that I have, you know? So yeah. As y'all can see, they're like fairly new. Haven't really worn them. Well, I have, I have, I've worn them like two or three times, but really nothing to wear them with, you know? So green and yeah. So moving on, last pair of shoes. I have the Nike Rashi ones. And the reason these are actually, this is meant for last because these are special if that makes sense. Yeah, these are, yeah, yeah. As y'all can see, nice curly white. Basically the damn Daniels, I guess. Damn Daniels of Nike, okay? Now, these, I love them, okay? Why did I get white shoes? I don't know. I wanted to stand out, I guess. And because you can't really wear white shoes to school, especially to school, without them playing around and get them dirty, you know? So, getting them dirty. So I got these like back in February, I guess. You can't really tell that I got them back in February, but hey, I, I wore them about two or three times to school. Can't, like I say, there's no real way to wear them, I guess, without them getting dirty. But I don't know, I might, I could put some like Crip Protect on them. And there's some, so they're like, there's something that I really need to get. I want to put them on the, on the bottom of all my shoes, in fact. And there's, you like, it's like some silicone, or actually it's like some plastic. You heat it up like with a blow dryer or something. And it like wraps around the soles and on the bottom so you don't get them dirty. You just get the plastic dirty and then you can take them off and then the shoes are, you know, just so you don't get the shoes all dirty and everything, you know, so keep the shoes in clean condition. But that is all. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. You know, if you, I guess if you have any questions about any shoes, just hit me up, you know, email me or comment below. And I guess if you want a pair of shoes, just I guess let me know. I mean, I can see what I can do if I can. I don't, I really don't want to sell my shoes. But I mean, if I have to, I guess I might. I don't know. To use, I might. I don't know. I have to get you something. I must say something real quick about these one pair of shoes. These, these Adidas. Now, if you get these, don't wear these in the in the rain because these are not meant for rain. Okay, had those. They don't leave a stain, but when you get them wet, they just take some in to dry at least. You know, so they tried to sell me some like you know some water protectant at finish line but i was like nah i'm good you know but yeah so if you have any question about any shoes if you you know if you want to buy like you know if you feel like you're about to purchase some or if you're gonna purchase some in the near future you know hit me up like i said about any shoes that you have a question on and i might can help you out before you buy them you know what what you should buy what you should be aware of if anything happens like Rashi's what you should be aware of is just a like that's what I hate about Rashi's the white part the white uh, styrofoam I don't know what these are you know yeah what this material is but uh they crease and also they're white the only ones that don't have white is like the all black ones all red ones all blue ones just all one color ones you know but yeah just be careful and what you can do to clean these up is put put some uh, bleach on them but yeah use some bleach to clean them up and you should be straight the only thing yeah they wear out but i mean they're shoes you know shoes are shoes i mean if you need a new pair you can go get some okay i don't think it's that hard to get some shoes you know i mean some people it is i understand but nowadays bro you can get shoes anywhere okay and yeah if you need shoes you get shoes all right oh and also i was being dumb you know the lazy way of putting on shoes just they're tied you know just putting them on like as it is and i bent them and they have a metal piece in the back i think it's metal i don't know but these other shoes the uh, the other nikes i had there's like eight years Years ago there was a metal piece in the back and it stabbed my heels so i had to return them and they gave me a free pair of shoes well another pair yeah so i think they had to take them back too yes yeah, so i don't know yeah these are bent but these are the i don't give a shoes so yeah that is all guys like i said you know have any questions hit me up if you want me to do shoe reviews or whatever i mean i can do whatever you request you know i'm, I'm not gonna become a hype beast although the shoes that i have i feel like i'm a over beast if you make if that makes sense like i have too many pairs of shoes you know too many pairs of the same shoes rashi's like what the heck what is wrong with me? i feel like when i walk in walk into school with a new pair of shoes i just i don't know and it's crazy because literally my freshman year of high school, I only wore Sperry's, which I have right here. I only wore these and like, might have had one pair of like tennis shoes, but that's it. I just wore Sperry's as a day. Like, bro, I would wear those out and I did wear them out. And I had those, I wore those my eighth grade year and then I wore those my freshman year. And then actually my sophomore year, I switched it up by wearing tennis shoes. And then my junior year now, I'm wearing 
all of these shoes okay but yeah and it really changes your appearance and everything but uh no i don't have any j's so a black person not have any j's i guess that's rare i don't know but i don't really care for j's or jordans you know they're same thing every single time i'm sorry for all the hype beast and all the sneaker beast and all the sneaker youtubers out there but really they come out with the same jordans every weekend okay they just they just want your money and actually i don't even think michael jordan's and actually i don't even think michael jordan still makes the shoes i mean i think they just let nike take over and they did whatever they wanted to do but anyways i'm gonna stop rambling if you want me to get some jays i'll get some jays okay you know for the time being and until i get a job you know I'm, then the shoes might start racking up you know i feel like i want to get it up to the ceiling so a couple more pairs of shoes which actually i have they're just have some band i don't wear them i just have them in the box so it goes up to like right here at least a little bit excessive but oh oh well but yeah like i said if you enjoyed the video give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't already subscribed please subscribe to my youtube channel chris Cam 41 for more videos like this reviews whatever more shoes 2017 tour whatever you guys want i can make it happen like i said like I said, more videos like this are better. They're better videos, trust me. There could be some more sneaker sneaker videos if you guys want. And like I said, if you want more sneaker videos, I can get them to you. Reviews of any shoe. I might make another channel for sneakers. I'm not sure because I don't really care about shoes. Like, I don't want to do reviews. That's not me. I Like, I'll give you guys a tour. But other than that, that's like as far as I'll do it. But if you guys want to see a review, I might make another channel and do reviews on it. But yeah. But other videos coming, it's my break. So if you guys, like I said, if you want to see a video of whatever, I'll try to make it. I have a couple videos in, in mind that I want to do, but just don't have like the time to do it. But I'll do it for you. Anyways, hope you enjoyed. Give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, ChrisCam41, for more videos like this and better. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace. I dream, got a lot. I dream. Got a lot. I dream, got a lot. Cranberry with that vodka, I dream, got a lot. I dream, got a lot. I dream, got a lot. Gregor's blue so rock because I dream, got a lot. I dream.